Hello once again, I am Jim Ducart with TND How Videos. Today we are in Lancaster, Pennsylvania, where we will be touring TRC's Testing and Commissioning Lab and Training Center. So let's go on inside. Hi, my name is Jason Hostetter, Senior Vice President of Field Operations here at TRC. Welcome to our Lancaster facility. This facility has been designed to simulate a typical utility environment. All the equipment is designed to operate just as it would in the real world. We want our employees to experience the feel of being in a live substation where they can experiment and make mistakes without affecting reliability. We demonstrate and teach how to safely and efficiently test and commission equipment and protection systems in this controlled environment. Students from all disciplines attend the training. Engineers gain valuable experience. Construction managers and project managers are given insight into testing and commissioning processes and procedures. The exposure to this training builds a foundation of fundamental skills that makes them well-rounded engineers and technicians. This also provides them the guidance and tools to maximize job performance and better serve our clients. Hi, I'm Brian Moores, Chief Engineer, Testing Commissioning Services for TRC. Um, we're gonna take a moment to walk through our, our Lancaster training facility, our protection and controls lab. Training lab physical arrangement includes two 115 kV line sections, a 115 kV ring bus, a 115 kV to 34 kV power transformer, two 34 kV buses, and two 34 kV feeders. The six cabinets in the control house include real applications of protective reeling and schemes, controls, metering, annunciation, and an RTU. In addition to the traditional protection and communication schemes, the training lab has built a fiber optic ethernet and will utilize the IC61850 standard. So as, along with the control house, we wanted to simulate a substation yard. Uh, so we've developed uh, this space here. If you want to follow me to our, our quote unquote yard. So what we've got set up here is, is an arrangement with simulators, breaker simulators, transformer simulator, 34 kV breaker, et cetera. Uh, we can start at the 34 kV side. So these are our feeders, our bus tie, our low side transformer breaker. And these are basically breaker simulators. Um, you know, we have some spacing and, and footprint uh, considerations, so we tried to, to make this as small a package as we could, so we built these simulators. And they're very similar to, uh, you know, the mech house for a typical, in this case, we're simulating a vacuum circuit breaker. We have all of our VT junction boxes, again, very similar to what you might find in the yard. The goal here is for our folks to be able to more closely replicate what they're going to see in the field without actually having all the uh, physical issues to do with all the devices. Here we have our 115 kV 34, uh, 115 kV to 34 kV transformer simulator. Again, a large power transformer, doesn't really fit here. It makes it hard to find all this, in, this uh, equipment and crawl all over it. So we, we put it all at the student's fingertips here and we combine it into a, one package so they can actually get their hands on the real equipment. So we have some gauges and monitoring devices, sudden pressure, pressure relief, we have enunciation, we have our load tap changer, paralleling controls, cooling controls, and again, if you open up and look in here, you see, again, very similar to a, a, a transform mech house that you might see in, in the real uh, substation application. In addition to our protection and controls training lab, TRC has developed a series of courses that we're calling the TRC Power Academy. These courses are designed and developed for our new hires, our new testing commission personnel. It includes courses like safety, human performance, protection controls, power fundamentals, relay testing, outage and energization planning, and a, and a couple others. Uh, they're designed to provide a good foundation for our, our new testing commissioning personnel, uh, build that foundation prior to them going out into the, the substations into you know, the, the more risky environments. Hi, I'm Steve Pursuti, Vice President of Business Development in the Utility Market Sector for TRC. Thanks for watching this video. We invest in our people, we invest in technology, we invest in safety, quality, and human performance, and we invest in our client standards and our client specifications. When clients come to visit this facility, they're very impressed. In fact, uh, there's been times when the clients have wanted to hire our uh, students who are in the class right now before they even graduate. Uh, they have been beginning to, some utilities have begun to actually send some of their own teams in for training, and we have others considering doing more of that right now. Uh, one good thing about this uh, facility is Jason and his team have been very good about actually customizing the training to fit the needs of the client. 
Uh, in some cases, clients may have preferences or procedures that are different, and with that, we can train on those preferences so that when a, a personnel go to the field when they're deployed to the job site, they're already up to speed on the client preferences, and it really helps to uh, facilitate starting up jobs in a timely manner.